Hello YouTube, Eden Droid here and in this video I'm gonna route a custom recovery called Twerp TWRP on my Galaxy Note 2. So let's get started. Welcome back. Okay, so here I have my Galaxy Note 2. Uh, the first thing that I have to do is put it in download mode. So like you all know, volume down, home button and power button all together. Oops, it's on. <laughs> first you need to turn it off. So let me turn it off first. Uh, yep. Okay, so there are many methods available in the market. Uh, right now you can find that on XDA and other websites as well. But I always prefer Odin method because it just it is just the most authentic and easiest method and there are least chances of breaking your phone there are other applications available like uh, goo manager and I'm just putting in download mode and click up so you should see the screen so there are applications like goo manager and um, rom manager the thing is that it works for some people and for some people it doesn't work uh, and for some people for whom it doesn't work it it even breaks their phone so you know I have been getting a lot of messages of uh, people asking me oh what to do I use the software and you know this happened and that happened and all that so I'm always like um do not use it I mean go with the authentic way use Odin to do it and Odin is pretty easy you know just just you just need to use the link below this video to download these uh, this Odin the file and if you use the correct file ev everything is gonna be fine it's it's the easiest method the quickest method and I think you know um, it's kind of the official method okay so I have my note 2 in downloading mode I'm just gonna plug it in you need to have your USB drivers installed again everything will be in the description the links and everything uh, in case you can't find the USB driver to be working for you, you can download Samsung keys from samsung.com because it installed, installs the drivers uh, required for your device. And yeah, when, when you're using Odin, you should turn off. You should make sure that the keys is turned off because both of them don't really like each other. So my phone is added. You can see it says added right here. I'm going to zoom a bit. Yeah, it says added right here and um, it has the com port has turned yellow so I just have to simply click on the PDA I have to select the right TAR file which is open recovery twerp the link will be in the description and this is all you have to do on Odin now you just need to wait and watch and press start so it's just flashing the recovery Everything is done, passed, 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 and my cell phone is restarting already. Obviously, for Odin, you need to be rooted. Uh, sorry, obviously, for your recovery, you need to be rooted. So make sure that you are rooted in case you don't know how to root your smartphone, um, namely Note 2, you can click on this video on your screen. So this thing has started and it is, it, it has, you know, it, it should now be having twerp with it. I'm just going to turn it off and I'm going to turn it on uh, the recovery. The combination is a little bit different than the boot combination, so let's just do that. Let it let it turn off first. Turn off, turn off, turn off, turn off. Hello, turn it off. Okay, just okay, it's off now. Let me just unplug it. And yep, okay. We are ready to turn it on the recovery. You need to press volume up, home button and power button all together. Keep pressing it, keep pressing it, keep pressing it, keep pressing it and now release. You need to wait for the screen to show the sign again like two times. And here we are. 
TWERP stands for a Team Win Recovery Project, as you can see right here in the name. So this is your custom recovery. The reason um, I wanted to install this custom recovery because apparently this is the newest custom recovery in town, and it is touch recovery, so that kind of makes Clockwork Mod pretty outdated. So you have everything here. If you want to reboot, you can reboot right here. There are settings, restore, backup. Okay, yeah, Clockwork Mod recovery, restore and backup will not work on this. So you cannot restore Clockwork Mod recovery backup files and vice versa. Uh, and you can just simply install, you know, I just I just uh, touched install and you can install any zip, a custom ROM using this. So I'm going to do a video on, on that as well. And that is it. So we have basically installed uh, the custom recovery. Let's just reboot our phone. We can reboot to system. We can power off. I don't know why there is a bootloader. It's a Samsung device. There is no bootloader there. Or you can reboot into recovery. So I'm going to reboot to system. And it is rebooting. So that is about it. Uh, just flash away and don't worry about anything have fun this is why you have an android phone so yeah and don't forget to rate comment and subscribe see you in my next video